I've gone and bought myself AJ Sigma and the price range on, on it was £75 I paid 67 for it I've seen people could pre-order it for cheaper anyways now starting off this is my first time ever buying a game set now I have bought Warhammer stuff before just for painting I've never bought a game um, I have picked up some stuff for car booties but first time ever buying a game so this is my first unboxing ever of something like this yeah so let's have a thing of jiggery peel it off and have a look inside okay well, I um, don't know what they are I think there's the ladders to help the uh, blokes climb up into buildings so that's handy Bases. They'll go into the drawer with the other thousands of bases. Now, first look at these. I do like these. Um, these are really, really nice figures. Let's just first look. Um, if we, uh, now these look like chaos. Um, they're really quite sweet there. Um, so we got them fellas. Um, this is, I think, this thing here is what's on the box, uh, front box is like a, a rhino thing, me jiggy, and there's another, like, thing here with this thing here, so, I can't work out if this is chaos or not, so I'll have a proper look at that, so it looks like we got five sprues and all, so, um, five sprues, Really nice looking detail. Um, I'm just going to see how they um, actually go together. Um, last one, so it's probably similar. Um, oh, here or not? There's a big beastie fella there. Now, for for the money I pay for it, go by Games Workshop standards. They ain't too bad. You get your dice. You know. They'll just go into my other box of dice and this thing here, which is, um, you know, I can only assume it is like a drum or something, you know, scratchy. scratchy. Oh, there's more scratchy things. So you get three scratchy things. Alright, we'll figure out what they are there. And then before I open the book, you get um, decals, decals, de decal, decals. Right, and then we're on to the book. Now, I will be playing this game. Well, let's have a look at the book first on the front cover. Artwork is, eh, you know, it's alright. I've seen better artwork. Um, let's um, open this without destroying it now. Give me, bear with me two seconds there now. Um, you know. So, let's have a look at the book. Alright, so it's two books, you know. I think it could be more. But at the moment it's two. You got this one here. So the Warbands of Corn, Stormcast Eternal. So this is all this is your putting your stuff together and uh, thing. This is quite detailed because usually when you get it when you get a games workshop stuff is usually just like on the box, you don't actually get things. So that's quite quite cool. Yeah. So Am I am I getting sixty seven pounds worth of stuff? And another little Um I'm assuming this is you know this is your I, I don't think this is a point space game. Um so it just get, I don't know, get, helps you along with the game. Um over here, enemy and what are this like charge phase, battle shop phase. Means <laughs> to me. And then we go on to the book itself. Now it seems a lot lately they've been doing hard covers. This is quite quite a thick magazine. Um, so uh, I say the front cover's alright. It's not. It's not. You know, that's a, a good view of, of them built up. So that's quite cool. That's that's better artwork there. I think. You know what I'm saying that's quite good artwork. And um, Legend of War. So, you know, so it's, it's your pretty basic standards, 
That's uh, somebody already me ringing me up wanting to buy this off me because it'll be a good job done. But I might finish with the fucking thing. So, what do I think? Um, first look, not bad. Playability for somebody who's a novice, I don't know. But you know, um, I heard it's very basic, um, but then I've never played a Warhammer game. What, what turns me off Warhammer game and going to Warhammer shops or game workshops? You walk in there and it's full of 12 year old boys and playing games and you know you kind of feel like michael jackson at a disco you know it's not for me and um, i do go to a giant world club uh world gaming club and um, this is near enough historically uh, based and i enjoy it um i enjoy going there um but i've only been going for about four or five months um and not every week um work commitments but i do enjoy it is um i, I do like history so but I'm definitely going to give this a, ga a go um, and going back to other the games workshop games and all that you know you fuck me if you haven't been playing it since you were a 12 year old boy it's convoluted um, you know such and such as a, as a wizard and can do things so first look novices look um, let's hope we have this fella let's have look at that fella let's hope I have that in the box when I get the painting um, but uh, we'll see Thank you very much.